Can traditional farming methods sustain the rapidly growing global population? This question stirs the minds of many, as the world's agricultural landscape faces an impending crisis. Traditional farming, a practice as old as civilization itself, has provided food for billions for centuries. With time, traditional farming has evolved, incorporating technology and advanced techniques to increase yield. But the question remains, is it sustainable in the long run? Traditional farming is reliant on favorable weather conditions, fertile soil, and vast tracts of land. It requires large amounts of water and is susceptible to pests and diseases. Moreover, the constant tilling of soil leads to erosion and degradation, threatening the very foundation of this age-old practice. Now, consider vertical farming, a revolutionary approach to agriculture that could potentially address these challenges. Vertical farming is a method of growing crops in vertically stacked layers, often integrated into urban structures like skyscrapers or repurposed warehouses. It's an innovative solution that utilizes space in a way traditional farming simply cannot. When it comes to efficiency, vertical farming triumphs. It uses up to 95% less water than traditional farming, thanks to its closed-loop system that recycles water. It also eliminates the need for pesticides, as the controlled indoor environment significantly reduces the risk of pests and diseases. In terms of sustainability, vertical farming shows promise. It operates independently of weather conditions, ensuring a consistent yield throughout the year. It also reduces the strain on natural resources, as it requires less land and water. Furthermore, by bringing the farm to the city, it significantly reduces the carbon footprint associated with transporting produce from rural farms to urban markets. As for productivity, vertical farming shines. It can produce crops year-round, unlike traditional farming which is often limited by seasons. Plus, the controlled environment allows for faster growth, meaning more harvest cycles per year. Some studies suggest vertical farms could be up to 100 times more productive per square foot than traditional farms. To summarize, traditional farming, while crucial to human sustenance for centuries, faces challenges in terms of sustainability, efficiency, and productivity. Vertical farming, on the other hand, overcomes these hurdles, offering a promising solution to the global food crisis. It is efficient, using minimal water and no pesticides, it is sustainable, reducing strain on natural resources and minimizing carbon footprint. And it is productive, with the potential to yield significantly more per square foot than traditional methods. In conclusion, while traditional farming and vertical farming each have their strengths and weaknesses, it is clear that the future of agriculture lies in innovation and the adoption of sustainable practices. As the world population continues to grow, so too must our methods for producing food. Vertical farming presents a viable, sustainable solution, a beacon of hope for the future of agriculture.